when rainfall uh, hits the ground, um, it either gets absorbed into the earth or it turns into runoff. Um, and so the, the ground has a certain amount of capacity to absorb, suck up that rainwater when it falls. And if you have trees and vegetation there, it increases that capacity. So there you have it. Of course, more water going into the ground means less runoff and flood risk. So that's one reason Portland's Planning and Sustainability Commission protects natural resources in the city. The PSC uses environmental zones to determine areas that should be protected. And now, thanks to new technology in terrain mapping, the commission is proposing an updated map that will protect areas missed when the zones were created. When we look at the existing e zones that were adopted in the 90s and we overlay them with this adopted natural resource inventory, we realize that there are lots of resources that, that were just missed back in the in the 90s when these overlays were first drawn. So. The proposed zones will go before City Council and if approved are scheduled to be implemented by October 1st. Well, Coin 6 has a new